It's a beautiful April day. Mark Basket and his girlfriend are driving to a family picnic. Then, they are in a catastrophic car accident. Mark has suffered a traumatic brain injury. At the hospital, Mark's parents are informed that he is in a coma and showing almost no brain activity. They prepare to say goodbye to their son. But as Emory doctors change their despair to hope, Emory is the one place in the world conducting a study using progesterone to minimize the damage to the brain's neurons. The study is called PROTECT. Within 11 hours, Mark receives treatment. Afterwards, doctors are hopeful he'll be released from the hospital within a year. Mark is out in seven weeks. This is Mark today. He's back to work and healthy. He doesn't remember the accident. And hopefully, if his progress continues, he'll have no signs of ever having been in one. Following a traumatic brain injury, nerve cells that were not originally damaged become hyper-excitable and die. An Emory doctor was the first to discover that this neurotoxic cascade can be reduced with progesterone. Progesterone is critical for the normal development of neurons in the brain and may have protective effects on damaged brain tissue. Emory leads the world in this area.